And the last to link up is the favorite, Chi Tu. Stand by for a start. Chi Tu to the outside gate. Martin Garcia in the field about to be sent away. All in, locked up. Racing in the Sunland Derby, Global Strike in some bother at the break, got cut out. And showing out is Garen on the inside, Bourbon Eyes, they began the sharpest. And Chi Tu angling across from the extreme outside, lobs into second spot. And tracked up nicely by Tanzanite Cat, the center. On the outside of them is Midnight Hawk, Global Strike has recovered. And in the center too, Lawley's Gold as they bunch up. Rebranded out the stretch is caught a bit wide and the early trailer is going to be commissioner There's only about five lengths covers the field and Garen's in front Garen by a length to Chi Tu lobbing along nicely in second spot Midnight Hawk the stable made one away third Tanzanite cat on the inside a length and a half to global strike now starting to stride nicely on the outside in fifth back on the rails Bourbon eyes third last rebranded then Lawley's goal and the trailer is commissioner as they head down the back stretch and Garen still in front Garen by three parts, but wearing this leader like a glove is Chi Tu on the outside. And Midnight Hawk stalking in third, one away. One to Tanzanite Cat, Global Strike the center, sent forward and running on. On the outside, Rebrander getting to work and they've got away. Two lengths to Bourbonize has dropped out. Commissioner is well back and is starting to wind up now and last Lawley's goal. But Chi Tu has gone up to take the lead and Chi Tu and Midnight Hawk joining Garen. And Midnight Hawk, three wide and Mike Smith descend on the leaders. Midnight Hawk on the outside has gone to the front. Chi Tu in second. Garen under pressure. Rebranded is only two behind them. And Global Strike is struggling. But it's a Bob Baffert pair turning in front. And it's Midnight Hawk and Chi Tu battling this one out with Rebranded running on. Chi Tu on the inside back in front. Midnight Hawk the outer. The length of the stretch to separate them. It's Chi Tu and Nose in front. Midnight Hawk coming back on the outside. But Chi Tu prevailing and drawing away from Midnight Hawk. And it's Martin Garcia and Chi Tu who will go on and win the Sunland Derby well. Chi Tu is first. Midnight Hawk is second. Third is Commissioner who came from the clouds and then rebranded. Here in the winner's circle for the Sunland Derby, assistant trainer Jim Barnes, jockey Martin Garcia for Chi Tu. You were drawn outside, but you didn't seem to have much trouble getting a position. I was having a good position, plasma is a really hood that I was, and then I just take a bandage. There were a couple of horses in front of you when you turned down the backside. Was that, uh, was that helpful to have a little target there? You know what, I wasn't really asking yet. Uh, the horse out, it was outside, they asked before me, and then I just waited on top of the stretch, and then when I asked, he just responded, and then just went. Could you feel Mike Smith coming up on you? Yeah, well, he was all around me, so <laughs> I, I, I can feel it, but like I say, I was having plenty of horse. And distance-wise, you think this horse can keep going further? My horse? I think it won't be no problem. Very good. Very good. Well, it's good to be a habit. It's two years in a row for Martine. Jim Barnes, a good day for the Baffert Stable. Good day for the Baffert Stable. Another yes, Oaks. Another one, Oaks one, 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 two, two in the Derby. Time, yes, that was what did you think of each of your horses? Well, you know, right from the beginning, I was happy with the way they handled the paddock. They went through the post parade, post parade well, uh, and the break was good. I mean, it figured out just how I planned it, and, uh, and you know, Martine went to the lead. Mark, uh, Mike was to the outside. And uh, it was just a matter if they were going to get the distance or not, and they certainly did. The, uh, the winning owners, the Chews, have not been in the business an awful long time. This might be the biggest win the, they've ever had. This is probably their biggest win they've ever had. They had the Southwest last year and uh, the Sunland Derby this year. So. so if all goes well, I know Bob makes the decisions, but don't see any reason why we might not look down the road. Oh, yeah, you know, those are all decisions Bob makes, and, uh, you know, we just take it one race at a time, and just happy to, to be here. Well, not only happy to be here, happy to take home the uh, lion's share of the money from the Sunland Derby. Congratulations once again to the Connections of Cheetah.